Hey, I'm Michael Martin. Thanks for joining me today. We're over at the Reserve at Lake Kiwi. If you're on my website now, you can actually go to the link there for the communities and click on the subdivision uh, that says the Reserve at Lake Kiwi, and that will give you a lot of information about this private residential 3,900-acre lakefront community here on Lake Kiwi itself. Go ahead and talk a little bit about the house that we have listed today. Brand new listing just coming out here on the market. The physical address is 206 East Fort George Way. And the home site here in the reserve that it sits, sits on is site number 53. And it's over in the C section, C53, and that's in Fort George Point, one of the most prestigious uh, parts of the reserve uh, that we're in today, okay? Go ahead and tell you a little bit more about it. It's on about 2.44 acres and about 275 feet of water frontage tucked into a nice private cove with a cover dock in place and uh, we have good water here in this cove where we are today okay uh, this home is a little over 3800 square feet finished four bedrooms three and a half baths it's about six years of age um, it's kind of a you know a cottage design home here in the reserve. You got your stack stone, cedar shake roof, uh, board and uh, batten siding. So it kind of gives it that cottage feel. We're going to go through it in a, in a minute. Look on the outside. And go ahead and look on the inside. And let you get a feel for that. Okay, open floor plan. You got the master on the main. So just the way it flows on the main floor. You know, it ability to do a lot of entertaining. You can go from the kitchen to the gathering room, or the I call it the gathering room. It's the den. Go back and forth. Be able to watch TV and just you know. At a lake house, it seems like everything's always centralized around the kitchen. It's like everybody's is always hungry when you're at the lake because you're outside doing stuff. So you got that combination of being able to go right out on the on the porch, go right down to the lake, or be in the kitchen, be in the den, watch TV, and just get a lot of people in there all together without being separated by a lot of walls. So real, real nice, nice floor plan here. Uh, heart pine floors, got heart pine floors basically throughout the main home itself. I uh, got exposed beams, which kind of gives that that lake mountainy feel, that uh, nice cottage you feel. Got th three fireplaces, one on the main floor, one downstairs, one outside on, on one of the covered porches. Uh, you got three bedrooms and two more full baths downstairs. So uh, that gives us a total of four bedrooms. And we got about a, a little over a thousand square feet of decks and porches. Some decks covered, some uncovered. Uh, so over a thousand square feet of outdoor uh, entertaining area in this home. This home in today's market is priced at $995,000, which includes the dock, the rock that's already in place, the lot itself, obviously, and the home that's already here built today. It's a great value in the reserve, and it's under a million dollars. It's a great value. It's a real good price point, and it's got those characteristics that a lot of buyers in today's market are looking for because, you know, it's not a 5,000 square foot home. It's manageable, just over 3,800 square feet. Another unique thing about this property is at 2.44 acres, you've got the home down here on the water, but up behind us, you have the ability, enough. there's enough land behind us up on the hill where you can go in and build a guest cottage and have nice mountain views looking out over the lake. So uh, you got a different option here of different things that you could do. One of the unique properties in the reserve where you have enough room to go in and build you a, you know, a nice cottage style home with with views and a lot of separation and on a lot of land at you know 2.44 acres so let's go ahead uh, i'm going to show you a little bit of the outside then we're going to head on into the inside and get a better feel for it 